Hello you two, and welcome to this Let's Play of Soma. This game should promise to be pretty scary and lead to some great adventures, so without any further ado, let's get right into it. Alright, here we go. Fade to black. Reality is that which when you stop believing in it, doesn't go away. Philip K. Dick. Simon? That's me. I think you're bleeding. Hi, Simon. Oh, that, that's nothing. It's just my brain can't stop bleeding from the accident. Right? I'm Simon, I think. Pretty sure I'm Here, Simon. Here, take this. No, that, that's for later, for the scan. It's green. Ashley, I need to tell you something. Simon, please don't make this weird. Don't make it weird, Simon. No, no, it's not like that. Why now? Who's David Munchie? Why is there never enough time? For what? What the fuck just happened? Christ. Oh, move. Okay, I'm playing now. Okay, here we go. Yeah, Answering the phone. Step one. Hi, Simon Jarrett? Yeah, that's me. It's me. My name is David Munchie. We spoke earlier. The brain scan. I remember. Are you alright? Yeah. Yeah, just a bad dream. Are, are we still on for today? Yeah, that's why I'm calling. I wanted to remind you to drink the tracer fluid I sent you. It'll help me capture a better image of the damages. Don't worry, I I, I got it somewhere. Okay, great. Well, I'll see you in a couple of hours then. Okay, see you soon. Okay, so apparently I'm Simon, and I have a big bleeding gash in my forehead, which you need tracer fluid to see. Okay, so move around. Computer. Uh, thank you again for participating in our research. This game will be performed at Pace Laboratories in Toronto, but since we are guests, our access is a bit unpredictable. I will try to schedule a scan session for Saturday. I'll get back to you when confirmed. Sincerely, David Munchie. Dear Mr. Garrett, happy to hear your headaches have become less frequent. Your latest tests show your brain is slowly recovering, but it's still too early to tell how well it will adjust to the damage. The bleeding will continue over the coming months at least, and you will need to come to the hospital a few times to drain the cavity. Ew. To prevent the blood from building up pressure. Since excessive stress could be fatal, I have written you a prescription for Prazosin. Prazosin. To help you with your nightmares. Oh, so that was one of my nightmares. Please read the instructions and medicate accordingly. Try to get a lot of stress and I'll see you next week. Drafts. <laughs> Forgot to hit send. Oh. Here. Does it matter? I already told him. Uh, I'll send anymore. that for you, buddy. It's no problem, really. Better late than never. Okay, that's all I can do here, it looks like. I think some, yeah, something was shining. Okay. Is this important? Doesn't look important. Doesn't look important. Okay. Then we got this guy. Throw. We can throw. Okay, let's let's see how strong I am. And... Huh! Okay. That was, that was, yeah, I can yeah, throw it across the room. Tra oh, tracer fluid. Okay. Looking for tracer fluid. Tracer fluid belongs in the fridge. Right next to the milk and OJ. Nothing but fast food. Should buy something healthier in my Okay, so no trace of food. But I am gonna need this later, so I'm gonna leave this right next to that guy. You know. Come on, Because I get food. hungry. Where are you? Anyways, so not in there. Drawers maybe? No. Doesn't look like trace of fluid anywhere. In here? Oh, this is the bathroom. This is not the time to use that. Trace of fluid in the shower. In the medicine cabinet. Haha, -ha, tracer fluid would be medicine, right? No, no no tracer fluid. Where does tracer fluid exist? Maybe in the cupboards? I don't know why you would keep it there, but there it is. what? Why would you put it next to your plates? All right, um, lots of other stuff, lots of words, eh, uh, ah, let's just put it inside me. Let's stop wasting time. We'll get it started. Is it gonna make me like pass out or something? Am I gonna Feels have another like nightmare? Milk, the taste. It's like oh, on a okay, so I leave, I guess. Hey, I got my keys. It means I'm ready to go do stuff. Let's go do stuff. All right, here we go, guys. Let's go on adventure with scary 
monster things on the subway. Nice sunglasses, underground, on the subway. Hello, crazy guy, talking to yourself. But in all fairness, I'm talking to myself right now, so. I mean, yeah. Phone, how do I answer my phone? Oh, that's how. It's a turnip. Oh, let's talk to the turnip, see what he has to say. Jesse. Hey, Simon, I got your email. Just wanted to wish you good luck and let you know I got you. Hey, I Thanks. sent that email. I should be able to come to the store after the scan. Don't sweat it. I got Matt and Chris help me out. Maddie from SNL? Uh, guess you didn't hear. He's coming in full time. Work in the comic section. That's Ashley's job. Yeah. Well, you know. Forget it. Not doing her any favors by leaving an empty spot. Not like she's coming back. Well, good luck. Hope they find a way to reverse the whole, you know, dying thing. <laughs> Dying thing? You're the worst support ever. <laughs> what should I say? I'll see you later, Jesse. Don't burn the place down while I'm gone. Over and out, buddy. Won't find me in a All right, I'm gonna try not to talk during the commentary scenes because I feel like this is a kind of game that won't have too many of them. So, try not to go over those. Okay, that was that was me sitting on a train. That was important, I guess. That was probably all just from that email. And then the door, the door needs some work. Hinge is a little rusty. Hello? Hello? Oh. Dr. Munchie? Psychic. There we go, that's better. Where is everyone? Oh my god. This place would be busy. That is, I see a creepy clown. What do you guys, oh, and a tightrope walker. What do you guys see? Let me know. Let me know what you guys see in the creepy nightmare painting. And some scary vent thing that I really hope I don't have to climb into. All right, are you gonna open? Oh, of place, course you right? won't open. It must be. That'd be too easy. Oh, that's me. Let's just call Machi real quick. Great. Got his phone turned off. That's okay. I can figure this out. Okay. So, do I have to climb up this? Mm, nope. I guess not. Maybe maybe there's like a secret button I can unlock it with. Alright, computer, what do you have to say? Paul, where are you? We got a few hours. I got a hold of Simon Jarrett. Let's do this. I saw your laptop in the reception. Are you already here? Call me ASAP. Okay. Hi, Paul. Talk to Pace about using the lab this week. I have managed to book the scanner for tomorrow morning and again on Friday. It's not a lot, but they say we could use the empty reception area as a kind of office. It would also allow us to use the computers to run models, and also if there's a time slot opens up, we can get in there and use the scanner rig right away. I thought we could run some tests tomorrow. We could do a scan of each other to learn the equipment. So these guys, wow, wow, these guys don't even know the equipment. And they're just going to start messing with my brain. What could possibly go wrong? It's supposed to be pretty easy. Well, I hope it's easy if you guys don't know how to use it. On Friday, I'm hoping Dr. Aaron Peek will send us somebody over. She had a patient, has a patient that was recently in a car crash. Probably me. Should be interesting. Ah, we're locked out. Here we go. Uh, next time lab. Uh, to code change, okay? Um, I'm not allowed to repeat the code in mails or texts, but I'll leave a note or something. Okay, so I need to look for a note. Note in the drawers. Nothing. No. No. Okay. Uh, this? Note. Nope, no note. Notebook? Aha! Okay. Uh, page 56. Uh, 20 to 30, Me. oh, okay, there, 2, 5, 0, upside down V, what the hell is that, is that, is that, is that 7, is it, a, is it a 4, what the hell is this, alright, well, let's, let's, let's get this unlocked first, and then we'll turn on the lights, before we go, because we're polite, 7, no, two, five, zero, four. Wait, maybe two, five, zero, seven. Enter, no. Okay, so. I don't, two, five, zero. Maybe, maybe it's a one? Is that, maybe? I don't know. Let's see if it's a one. Maybe, hopefully. Two, five, zero, one. Oh, okay. 
That was a weird sound. You write your ones really weird. So let's get this off and then we'll go ahead. Whoa. I heard something. We're getting out of here. Quickly. Close it. Nothing's getting us from behind. Alright, now I'm going to go ahead and take a guess that it's the one door that's open. But that's just me. Nope. Not that door. Okay, probably something in there. Oh. Oh, okay. So probably this way. So let's see what's in here first. This is open, so that means there's something super duper important in here, right? Can I do anything on the computer? Typey typey. Do some computer stuff? No. Got a chair. Got a light switch. Got a whole bunch of servers. And a whole lot of nothing. Okay. That was extremely helpful. Thanks for having a misleadingly open door. For no reason. Let's go talk to the crazy doctor guy who's gonna mess with my oh, head. Oh, hi. Didn't hear you come in. Simon Jarrett, right? That's Dr. Munchie? Well, it's uh, just Mr. Munchie, but I'm working on it. You're not even a doctor. Actually, you're helping me right now. Is this part of your thesis work? Wow. Yeah, it's a study I'm doing with my colleague, Paul Berg. We hope to design a gentle way to work with brain reconstruction to help people like you. Oh, did you uh, take the tracer fluid? Yes, yes I did. Great. Well, we can start whenever you're ready. Okay, so this not doctor is going to mess around with my brain with things he doesn't know what he's doing. Oh, do I just sit down? Is that it? Anything else in here before I do that? Anything? Anything? Nope. Okay. Let's let this totally not doctor doctor mess with my head. And now it's dark. Whoa. Okay. All right. Some Let me just vision. get this out of the way. You are Simon Jeff, yep. correct? That's me. Right. Toronto, Canada. Munchie. Born 1988, July 16th. Right. Flat neurograph. Version 6. Good. All files in order. Will this hurt? It's just a scan. It'll hurt about as much as getting your picture taken. Indians thought cameras would steal their souls. What? That's so. Well, let's hope they're wrong. <laughs> Ready? I'd Say cheese. A cheese? Yeah, I really trust this guy the more I learn about him. Okay. Was that supposed to happen? Was, was I supposed to do that? What happened? Okay, so... Can you get this off? Okay, yep. Okay, Hello? we are somewhere completely different now. That's, Mr. that's how this works. Oh, I, oh, I can move. Okay. Let's get up. All right. Did something go wrong? You, w dude, you woke up in a completely different room. What, what do you think? It's like a teleporter. That's, this isn't funny. Is that a body? Oh, okay. Thing. Do it. Whoa. Whoa. Broken glass window. Okay. At least it means I'm safe in here, right? Nothing can get in. This place? Yeah. Get nothing here? can get in. All right, um, so how do we get out of here? Because we're obviously too safe inside this room. We need to go find some danger somewhere. I can't open the door. I can't, I can't do anything with computer stuff. Do I need to climb out of a vent? No, that came from there. All right, you look hefty. You're going to be my friend and we're gonna make it through this whole game together. You, you're sturdy and tough, so you're coming with me. Um, do, can I break the glass, maybe? Like, oh, I can. Okay. See, you're already my best friend in this game. There we go. Okay, that's closed. Do not enter. Okay. Okay, let's... let's this is the beginning of the game. Let's go find some weird, creepy things to scare us. All for entertainment, of course. I need to use the bathroom. That, uh, trays of fluid just hits you pretty hard sometimes. So, no, nah, we need to put it down. Because we have manners. Close that. Alright. Good little break. Let's go, Mr. Extinguisher. Oh, and there's your friend. Uh, other extinguisher. I don't know. I'll come up with a name later for both of you, maybe. 
That's pretty gross. Uh, okay. Yeah. We're not gonna mess with that. That that stuff seems... I'm gonna pretend that it's oil, but I don't think it's actually oil. I think it's like liquefied people. Alright. Break room. Don't ever... Oh, okay. Data buffer. What does this do? It's working better than expected. They're having a really hard time getting the doors open. Who? Permit seal as many as you can. Rather not take any chances. Roger. Did you cut off the factory floor? All done. Should keep most of them out. I'm on my way to lock out the comm center. Just make sure to leave a way out of here. Trust me, I'll get you the data safe and sound. We just need to make sure we leave enough power running so we don't have to return. I hear that. See you back at camp. Okay, so it sounds like they kind of like locked some things in here, which probably one of them in this room. So let's open it up and go say hi. With my extinguisher, and I'm gonna hit him in the face. I'll boop the snoop. He won't even see what's coming. All right, my screen's going weird. What's going on? You got a little robot guy. Ooh, you look weird. What are you? Some like dinosaur robot thing? I don't know. What are you? Whoa, God! Oh, oh. <laughs> oh wow this game got me already that's oh no that's good early start okay that's how this game's gonna be awesome anything else you do anything yeah i should probably yeah. do you do anything do you d oh another one of these things already okay so it's gonna be that kind of game hey you can you talk yes can you talk like the others? Why wouldn't I? Oh, I can move during this. I thought I was stuck. Like oh, that's it. Whoa. Oh, God. Oh, what happened? Oh, what happened? Is it the thing? Is it coming after me? Alright, we have our fire extinguisher. We're brave. We're gonna go fight it. We're... Oh, it's gone. Oh, it's gone. That's not good. I don't... I like it better when I know where you are. Okay. Okay, let's let's chase it down. Where's this guy going? Where are you going? He just disappeared? I think this was him. Oh, here. Here we go. He went in here? Do I follow him? Hello? Do oh, okay. No? Okay, I can't get in there. Okay. So we just met our first little monster thing. They look like robots. That's not bad. They couldn't be. I mean, robots aren't scary, right? Oh. Okay. Okay. Is something trying to find me? Be less noisy. Be less noisy as I smack the fire extinguisher off every surface ever. All right. Okay. So I'm guessing that's where I go next. Maybe. Probably. Or I could go this way. Uh, but my door. My my screen was doing something weird over this way. So it's. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Oh, no, 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 I don't like those screams. Okay. Are you laughing at me? You're laughing at me. Okay. Well, just wait till I open this door, and then let's see you laugh when I smack you in the face with a fire extinguisher. Wait, no, no, with a fire extinguisher. There's... There's not... There's nothing even in here. What? What the fuck? Oh, gross. More of this stuff. You, you. Oh, oh, there's the first body. Body number one. Surprise, that's all we've seen so far. And we got Omni 2. Oh, it's shining. Okay, probably want... What do I do with this? What? Do, okay, do I scan something? Do I scan this? Oh, no, I just put it away. Inventory. How do I, it's my, oh, that's, that's my inventory. Just that. Awesome. Oh, wait. Yeah. That one, the screen in the room where we first woke up had Omni tool on it. All right. Well, let's, yeah, let's go back there. It wanted us to find an Omni tool and we found one without even really trying. So no, we're going to find it. Come on. Flashlight. Let's chase it down. We're going to get into our first fight. Where'd you go? Come on, we're not scared. We're not scared at all. Look at it. 
You don't scare us because we have a fire extinguisher. And we get. Oh, God. Okay, we're scared. we're scared. We're scared. We're scared. We're scared. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Go away. Please go away. Are you gone? Okay, I hear you stomping around. Do I? Okay, there's nothing. We're safe. Ha! I tricked him. We weren't really scared. We weren't really scared at all. A little bit, maybe. Wow, there's so many fire extinguishers everywhere. But this, there are many fire extinguishers, but this one is mine. Or something like that. I don't know the exact quote. Okay, so, oh. Yeah, back in here. Um, open that. Open that. Oh, come on. Open. Let's go. Fire extinguisher. You, you stay. Stay. Put it in here. And it should be doing a thing. Do, do the thing. Service console up to room three, including pilot seat activated. Ah, okay. So pilot seat's activated. That's, that's the thing I was sitting in, maybe? Probably? Okay. Not in search, so I need to find a tool chip. And a cortex chip? Come on. I just found the one... Oh, okay. I just found one thing. What what else do you need me to do? What the hell is this? Level three. Do I... No, not that. Oh, okay. What was that? Tool chip found. That was tool chip. That was easy. All right, we're making progress already. Oh, update. And what did that do? It did something. Tool chip security cipher. Cool. Updated. And then... Okay, go away. Then there was this. I think this was the last thing. I know they told you that field technicians would get full access throughout Pathos 2. Oh, it's a video. I'm here to tell you that's not going to happen. What? Don't get me wrong. Rip off. I don't want to get in your way. We need you guys to keep this place up and running. But there needs to be at least some level of security on these things. I don't want to hear you barge into some quarantined area at Omicron and just knock down the whole place with some virus or whatever the hell they're doing over there. This is what you can do. You'll be able to use it to open doors. Basically all of them. If you can't, there's something wrong or someone didn't want you in there. Then what do you do? You shove that Omnitool into a terminal and see if you can't get around it somehow. Just shove it in. Sometimes you'll need to get into places where you don't belong. Just find a way. You're an engineer for crying out loud. What else? Take care of your gear. Don't be an asshole. That's about it, really. That's kind of life motto right John there. Strohmeyer, Pathos 2 security operative. I got an office at Theta. Come see me if you got any issues you can't handle yourself. Good luck. Sure thing. Thanks. That guy's probably still alive. You know. For sure. Because I'm, I'm guessing everyone's dead. Okay, so that's, I guess, the first stage of this all done. Unless I need to find a Cortex chip, but I have no idea where that would be. Okay, so this monster thing came from here. There's some stairs down that way. Uh, oh, this is... Oh, I was already here. This is where I got the Omni tool. Can I go in here? No, nothing. Okay, well... I'm gonna go right here to these stairs. Alright, that, yep, that's where I swiped the Omni tool. Okay, well, I actually think I'm going to end the video here. Uh, thank you, everybody, for watching this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. And, um, yeah, I can't wait to keep playing this game. It's, it seems pretty good. You know, it's starting off. Got a, got a good scare so far. Got some monsters running around. And I'm hoping that we'll actually get to run into one next episode. So, uh, goodbye for now. Until next time.